so it's lit up. Donation centers are relatively small spaces, maybe 1,000, 1,500 square feet, with the purpose of allowing our communities to drop off to help us reuse, repurpose, and recycle. And we are proud of the environmental contribution they make. Last year alone, we enabled our communities to reuse, repurpose, and recycle over three million pounds of goods. <coughs> and this is the circular economy that we all want to see more of. Giving a second life to housewares, clothes, and toys, gathering donated inventory is a priority. And this is actually the way a lot of Goodwills grow. Um, they start with donation centers because unlike a typical retailer, thrift stores don't have inventory per se. We can't suddenly call up and say, bring me 12 more white shirts or five more pairs of jeans. So we need to generate our own donations. And having a rich selection of donations is really important for us as an organization, but also for our shoppers. Our retail enterprises, which include two thrift stores and this donation center, are a key part of the Goodwill model. They can provide a training ground for our job seekers to attain workplace skills before we help them seek community employment. They generate proceeds that we reinvest in that employment services mission right here in Halton. This first assisted donation centre in Halton has created new employment opportunities, hiring four new team members to help community donators bring in their contributions. So we really believe in valuing and expressing appreciation to our donors because without our donors we would have nothing to sell back to our communities. So the purpose of having an attended donation centre is so that it can be staffed, our staff come out, receive the donation, help the donor bring it in, express appreciation, it's just a much more service-oriented experience. It also allows us to hire people, and that's important to us. Now, I heard Kelly speak often about the power of work and its profound impact in transforming people's lives. It provides for the essentials of living, like food, shelter, and security. But that job also provides people with dignity and purpose. With raised interest rates and increased food prices, Goodwill Amity stores are seeing an increase in shoppers. They are aiming to open a new store every year starting in 2024. As we grow and build out our infrastructure, you'll see us in, in Milton, you'll see us in Georgetown, you'll see us in Waterdown, you'll see us in Stony Creek, and we look forward to that. Three, two, one. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Nikki Wesley.